With its sleek, streamlined body and world-class engineering, the Mercedes S-Class is a car to be coveted. But the Mercedes flagship model is not merely a paragon of timeless design. Many of the company's latest innovations are first launched via the S-Class, making it an embodiment of the cutting-edge technology that has long placed Mercedes firmly at the forefront of the automotive industry. The S-Class is a special car for us. It underlines our technology leadership. Yeah. All systems we uh, develop and we are bringing into market, we first do that in the S-Class. Our mission is to bring all these new systems, good systems, uh, safety systems, as fast as possible to all of our customers, not only to the S-Class customers. With safety as the driving force behind many of these innovations, Mercedes has developed the S500 Intelligent Drive concept car a research vehicle distinguished by its advanced driver assistance programs, including a system of radar sensors and stereoscopic cameras, which act as the car's eyes and ears, providing 360-degree visibility around the vehicle at all times. Mercedes' own brand of magic comes in the form of intelligent controls, which process the information received from the sensors, using it to predict what will happen on the road in real time. This represents a quantum leap in driver safety and brings Mercedes several steps closer to having cars that can drive autonomously. Passive safety, which is implemented in our cars, is one of our main goals. This vision leads us to new systems which makes our cars more safe for the people inside the car and also the people outside the car. With these sensors, we, we have two advantages compared to the human. We are faster in the recognition of the surroundings and other objects, and we have a wider field of view and the technique doesn't get, get tired. As part of Mercedes' rigorous testing process, the S500 Intelligent Drive prototype was taken out on German roads for a comprehensive 100-kilometer test drive. Driving completely autonomously, the S500 navigated the same historic Mannheim to Pforzheim route forged by Bertha Benz in the Benz Patent Motorwagen in 1888. In undertaking such a groundbreaking journey, precision was key. So Mercedes worked extensively with HERE, a global leader in navigational mapping intelligence, to meticulously map out every centimetre of the route. The first moment on the on public road with our car was really fascinating. The target was to drive autonomously in small villages, in cities, through rural roads and recognize or perceive pedestrians and cyclists and so on, and do that with other traffic around us, and the car did it itself. It was amazing. This technology is definitely cutting edge. We took uh, next generation mapping to really its full potential. We decided to collect uh, aerial imagery, we collected LiDAR data, we collected other sources from, from that particular drive, and we were able to build entire new virtual reality of that particular road. And Mercedes obviously is doing uh, a tremendous amount of work in being able to uh, take this data and with the help of the sensors that are in the vehicle really provide that superior driving performance. Every month, HERE collects data from over 30 billion probe points around the world, providing constantly updating real-time information about what's actually occurring on the roads, building and maintaining the most accurate navigational database currently available. This is an essential part of the evolution of the connected smart car, and it's exactly this collaborative ethic that is allowing companies like Mercedes to make such a seismic impact in the human driving experience. When you have a look in the future, we are convinced that we can provide with such systems uh, a real benefit for the customer. So he can drive, let's say, with 10, 20, 30 kilometers per hour in traffic jam and he can do other things. Work, watching films and so on. But that's in the future. Five to ten years from now, there will be more and more vehicles that will be able to leverage the automated driving capabilities, such as the ones that Mercedes has developed. But this is, in my opinion, one of the first instances when you actually were able to demonstrate for such a long stretch of a road where you had the various driving conditions, ability of vehicle to drive itself. And 100 kilometers of various road types is a, is a significant achievement on public roads. So I really believe that uh, Mercedes has done something pretty amazing here. Mm -hmm.